The European Elder Herb Basics in Ayurveda Common Names, European Elder, Black Elder, Elderberry, Elder Flower, Sambucus Latin Name, Sambucus Nigra Background European Elder is a tree native to Europe and parts of Asia and Africa, and it also grows in the United States. The name Elder comes from the Anglo-Saxon word Eld, meaning fire. The terms elder flower and elderberry may refer to either European elder or a different herb called American elder. This fact sheet focuses only on European elder. Various parts of the elder tree, including the bark, leaves, flowers, fruits, and roots, have long been used in traditional medicine. Currently, elderberry and elder flower are used as dietary supplements for flu, colds, constipation, and other conditions. The dried flowers elder flower and the dried ripe or fresh berries elderberry of the European elder tree are used in teas, extracts, and capsules. How much do we know? A small number of studies in people have evaluated European elder for various health conditions. Some of these studies used products that included several ingredients, so the actions of individual ingredients are unclear. What have we learned? Although some preliminary research indicates that elderberry may relieve flu symptoms, the evidence is not strong enough to support its use for this purpose. A few studies have suggested that combination products containing elder flower and other herbs might be helpful for sinusitis, but because the products contain multiple ingredients, it's unclear what role, if any, elder flower plays in their effects. There's not enough information to show whether elder flower and elderberry are helpful for any other purposes. Researchers funded by the National Center for Complementary and Integrative Health NCCIH, are studying the antioxidant effects of extracts from elderberry and their possible relevance to the body's defense against infection. What do we know about safety? The leaves, stems, raw and unripe berries, and other plant parts of the elder tree contain a toxic substance and, if not properly prepared, may cause nausea, vomiting, and severe diarrhea. Because the substance may also be present in the flower, consuming large amounts of the flower might be harmful, however, no illnesses caused by elder flower have been reported. Keep in mind. Tell all your health care providers about any complementary or integrative health approaches you use. Give them a full picture of what you do to manage your health. This helps to ensure coordinated and safe care. Thanks for watching the video. If you like this video then hit the like button below. If you like this type of video then subscribe to our channel by pressing the red subscribe button. If you don't want to miss such videos then hit the bell icon. Thanks for watching.